Hey guys, how are you doing? I hope you guys are doing great. So in this video, I'm going to try on this beautiful braided wig. If you find this video entertaining or interesting, make sure you give it a thumbs up, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. And also if you're interested in any of my wigs or any of my products or this one, I'll leave my details in the comment section down below so you can contact me and I'll send it to you. So this is the wig before I applied any uh, product on it, before I cut the lace. I know most of you are requesting me to make uh, wigs that have baby hair or wigs that have closures. And I'll try and make more styles with uh, baby hair or with closures. It has an adjustable strap and then it has a band as well. I'm going to show you how I always uh, do, do this. I always uh, cover this part on the side. And then right now I'm just cutting the the lace if you order from the website and you want me to cut the lace for you just let me know always leave me a note on the website if you want uh, me to maybe uh, cut the baby hair for you or uh, cut the lace for you or apply a foundation or concealer on the lace just to make it blend well with your complexion but then also you have to tell me your skin tone but also as well you can just buy the foundation yourself and then apply it on the lace as you can see without the foundation it doesn't look that natural so I always advise to just spray some water on the lace before you apply a foundation it kind of makes the concealer stick uh, on the lace and then you won't have to apply the foundation every time you try the wig on so there's this uh, part on the side that I always leave out and right now I'm just going to fold it and then sew it I always do that when um, I'm making a different uh, sizes of wigs you know I have small medium and large and then now when the wig is supposed to be medium I always leave this part on the side and then just fold it later and then I uh, sew it so if so if let me say if I was making a bigger size I wouldn't have folded the side I would have uh, added like uh, two extra braids on the sides so yeah because also most of you always ask me if I have sizes. Yes, I have small, medium, and uh, large. Especially if you od always order from the website, make sure you, you measure your width uh, well or the circumference of your head well just to be sure of your size. If, let me say, your head is medium and you pick a small one, I'll have to use a small dummy and that will make the wig smaller. So always just uh, pick your your size like my head size is uh 22 22 and a half and that is medium and uh, a bigger one is 23 23 and a half and then a smaller one is 21 25 and 21 and a half so again just always make sure you know your head size so for the baby hair, I'm going to apply this eco gel. You can apply any gel that you want. And then also, if you really don't want the baby hair, you can as well just cut them. And uh, yeah, because I know also some clients tell me it's, uh, they don't uh, they don't like wigs that have baby hair because they just can't manage it. So if you really don't want uh, the baby hair, you can cut it as well. You can just cut the, la the lace with the baby hair. Yeah. It sets me free. So as you can see, this is how it looks. And honestly, I really loved how natural it looked. And then I'm just going to put this band on it to make the baby hair lie on my forehead and also to make it look more natural. So guys, just comment down below if you love this style already. And then the color is 133. Uh, 133 is like almost like four. It's not too dark and then it's not too brown yeah it's a mixture of brown and black so guys what do you think about the the parting area honestly i feel like it looks more natural with the baby hair and uh, with the lace and also if you want this hair without the the baby hair without the lace just let me know again when you order from the website just leave a note and say you don't want it uh, to have the baby hair so this is uh, one of the styles that I made without the baby hair. It's almost the same same style, but it doesn't have a uh, baby hair, and then also it doesn't have uh, the parting. So I also f also find like uh, I also realize also some clients just prefer the ones that don't have baby hair. So again, guys, I know again, just check the description box down below for my details, for the contact details, how to contact me, uh, my website. I know someone is going to ask me, 
where they will get this wig, mm. how to contact me in the comment section down below. Guys, please I'll leave the details in the comment section down below and my number and uh, my website and email as well so that you know you get your products, you get your wigs. So far, I also just want to thank you guys for your support. I really, really appreciate. I really appreciate you watching my videos. I appreciate you buying my products. It really means so, so much to me. And uh, God bless you all. So again, this style, you can put the parting in the middle like this. If you prefer the parting to be in the middle. But now the bun at the back, it will be on the side. It won't be in the middle. Down to the ground. Dragon is constantly No, I, I won't make a sound I love the pain It sets me free It's wrong, I can't make right So that was it for today guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate just comment down below if you love this style if you love it with baby hair if you love the color and then also again if you're interested in any of my products i'll leave my details in the comment section down below so you can contact me and i'll send the products to you see you in my next video guys bye Cause you say those things Then shut me up Got no clue What you have found I'm a rose in thorns But you cut me down It's wrong